pearls, beautiful strand of beads. I, I wouldn't even know, Jay, where to recommend someone to go. First off, just right, let's just say appetite in, a, in an 18 inch necklace, let alone neon appetite. And there is a difference in that color. I mean, the, the appetite is absolutely breathtaking, but the neon appetite really does have that brighter neon undertone to it. Wouldn't you agree? Well, neon appetite is specifically neon appetite. So yeah. um, to answer your question, um, you know, like for the last year, um, I probably got, I had to sit more. So I, you know, I went out, uh, I've got a lot, I've been to, I've got a lot of friends that have retail stores. Uh, I've got to kind of cruise around and see what's out there in the market. You would be hard pressed to go anywhere, any jewelry store and find neon appetite. Okay, your chances of finding a necklace that's all pure neon appetite even any, even if you could find one that's this great, are you kidding me? I mean, you know, like that, that's the beauty of what we do. And, and I, I'm really, I'm so pleased that everybody, obviously, you know, we, we have so many educated viewers. I mean, people that have collected with us that really understand it and people get the fact how rare this is. It's a very rare occurrence to have neon appetite. That is like of all the, all the colors in appetite that you can have, this is the most prized. It is the highest end. You know, I, I love, you know, I love that, you know, they, they always say a picture is worth a thousand words, right? On Kenya, this is really showing, uh, uh, Kenya's the, the, is displaying it beautifully. But do you understand, she's in st still on stage lighting, so it looks, it looks great there, but you get it in real light, in natural lights, where you're not, you know, having it filtered through the cameras and stuff, it's even gonna look better. But you see, like Ken Kenya, when you're looking away from this, look at the size of this. Look, look at it on, and, and you can. Do you see, like, even with Kenya, can you see it's glowing? Yeah. Okay, it glows. It's got neon. It's like it's like you have a neon uh, light hanging around your necklace. Only it's natural, <laughs> and it's so something cool. Mother Nature made. And here again, the rarity of this material. It's not every day. I, it's not. Uh, it's uh, this is one of the ones like I said I've been been on for 26 years. We, the first time we ever brought this on, it blew out. It did some crazy number, and uh, I remember our buyer at that time, Marjorie, came to me and said, "Is there any way that we could do a today special on this?" And I just looked at her and laughed, and she didn't think that was funny. But <laughs> the thing is, is that the fact that no, you can't do this. I mean, you're you're just fortunate. Uh, any time that you can run into any material, but there is not volume on this. And this, to be honest with you, is one, if not, I, I, I can really say this I, with pretty much confidence, this is probably the largest neon appetite necklace I've ever, I've ever created. Mm -hmm. I've ne I don't remember making one this big before. This was really nice material. It was good sized material too. Wow. That's another thing too with the crystals. Normally this, um, the crystals on this are extremely, extremely little, very small. And so, you know, you have to, you know, you have to cut around what Mother Nature gave you, right? right I mean, right. you know, that, that's the thing. And that's, that's really the art of doing it also is seeing what you can do with that natural material, what you can design with it, and also give the biggest bang for the buck. And right? we're busy. Boy, you're getting a huge bang for your buck and nothing else like it. Uh, here's what's happening at this point. Last call on the earrings, just a handful now in the matching. I want to take that, it's like princess necklace off. Uh, I can't wait to Jay's point till you see this necklace in person. When you see it in person and see that color, you'll understand why we, we just get so unbelievably passionate. Oh yes. Speaking of, I want to talk about one of the buys of all time. I have 100, 100 lucky people. Uh, genuine Amber, Natural Malachite. It is a 90 second special or sellout. This was $250, I'm gonna go right out to Jay. Jay, my gracious, $149, we're $100 off. Talk about rare, talk about specialty. Before it sells out, Jay, tell us about this. This is also part of the gallery collection, correct? Yeah, this is part of the gallery collection. It's just the necklace and um, pendant that we have, just a very few. I mean, this is a ridiculous, stupid price, okay? <laughs> that, you know, here again, we're, we're the creators, we're the manufacturer. You're, you're, you're talking to the, the people that, that do it from scratch, okay? I mean, you know, we're, we're doing these from scratch. I couldn't manufacture this and sell it for that price, okay? That's just beyond crazy, that's beyond stupid. Um, but these are really gallery editions. If you look at this, where are you gonna see something like this, Nowhere. right? No You're only gonna see it in a gallery. You're gonna see it in a custom shop where they have somebody, custom designers, that are custom creating things, and they're doing it. I guarantee you, um, you're not gonna see that kind of value. And 
for a good reason, right? I mean, it, it takes, you know, it takes days, you know, if not weeks uh, sometimes to create one of these. It's just because of the situation that we have and the way that we've we formed our, our business and our niche business that we're able to even do it at the other price. The regular price was a fantastic deal. So, I mean, people are realizing this and I do, I, I do people that that's with our viewers. They're so educated. They know they get it. And they also know the jewelry world. Um, so, uh, and that's, I think that's the biggest compliment is people understand it and they know what the value is. And they, when you see something like this, when I see something they like this, it. I just go, oh my gosh. It's gone, Jay. Yeah, I hope that people don't <laughs> think that you can make it for that. No, it is 100% <laughs> completely gone. Congratulations, everyone. And we have yet another fabulous hour celebrating the 26th anniversary with Jay King. And let me give you a sneak peek of some of our goodies that are gonna be coming your way. And as always, we'd love to hear from you. If you've shopped with Jay King through the years, take a moment out, say happy anniversary. Tell us and share with others what they can expect with their very first J. King purchase. I can tell you this, a rare, unique mind finds and compliments like you've never, ever, ever received. Okay, hands down, this is what J. King would say. I, 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 I'm kind of speechless. Crazy, never will be done again impossibility this is not only tiger's eye it's cat's eye look at the size the largest of the beads we've ever ever offered customer favorite when we launched this at 110 dollars 89 dollars and 65 cents this is not costume jewelry this is a rare special unique find uh, today with five flex pays i can't get over this under 18 dollars i want to hear jade's expression but it's coming up look at every color you could imagine and that is that cat's eye so you have that continuous movement and the facets and you talk about any which way you look at this the colors the movement the earth tones the shades the reds the earth i mean it is just beautiful and we've never done anything like that uh, it was the first time at $110 $90 forget it forget it oh okay here this you have to see I have to hold it because this is the most beautiful first off how about being on being able to own a ruby tennis brace a tennis necklace wait a minute right most of us would be a dream come true to have a tennis diamond necklace can I tell you this is about I don't know 50 times rarer than being able to own a diamond tennis necklace. It is a customer pick. I can't wait to read the reviews for you. And I'm gonna be honest with you, we don't have many of these, but the thing being is, at $199, this is hundreds of carats of natural, genuine rubies. Rubies! You don't find anything like this. And to even be able to offer it at a sale price that's never been done with five flex payments, it's under $35, we'll ship it out to you. This is an anniversary special. I hope you don't miss out on. Hard part is, is I don't even know which one, what to change it on. I think I, gotta put, I think I gotta put my rubies on. I'm gonna put my rubies on. Anyway, I'm so confused. Oh, and you know what else? We even have Ethiopian opal tennis necklace. It's really super limited, it's coming up, but I just wanted to give you um, a little heads up on that. All right, let's get started, my friends, because this is where our collectors always, always uh, wanna know the stories behind it, because when I mentioned this earlier, this is Golden Mountain Turquoise. This is 100% exclusive to J. King. You are not gonna find this anywhere else except in Jay's collection and right here at HSN. It is, he owns, a, it's his own rough here. Uh, it is limited material. I'm gonna have Jay talk to you a little bit more about that, especially to be able to do a full beaded necklace. Uh, again, 18 inches with your two and three quarter inch extender in the back here and special feature price today. Normally it's $188, it's $169.14 everything all weekend. We're offering five monthly flex payments that includes all of our J. King, which is great. When you shop with any major credit card or debit card, we'll ship this out to you in the next seven to 10 or five to seven working days, you should receive it. Uh, you won't be disappointed. Right out to J. King, joining us via Skype. Happy 26th anniversary, my friend. This is a special, special turquoise. And I know you always get very excited when we talk about the Golden Mountain Turquoise uh, because you're not gonna find, we can confidently say, unless you're shopping here at HSN, you're not finding this anywhere else, correct, Jay? No, I get excited about turquoise and planes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and motorcycles. 
<laughs> motorcycles. Well, let's not even start the list. I okay? know, I know. Uh, we'll go my on wife forever. would be chiming in. Um, okay, here's the deal. Okay, uh, for people, in, or, yeah, I don't want to bore for because we have so many viewers that have been with us for a lot of them 26 years. Um, but you know, the thing that we specialize, the thing that we're known for, even in our industry. Okay, we're known for we're known for having the one of the largest varieties of turquoise. Now, I say this, I'm not aware of anybody that has more varieties of turquoise that we have in productionable quantities, okay? I'm not talking about people that have museums and they have specimens. I'm talking about productionable quantities of those different rough materials, turquoise roughs. And I have a lot of my turquoises in my career, 46 years, that I have, the only thing that I have is I have a specimen left of that turquoise where you can't even find it anymore, you can't get it. More, I have more of those than I have of material that I actually have. The reason I'm saying that, this is gonna be one of those, okay? Now, I can say without a doubt, we have an exclusive on this, nobody's ever even, nobody has any of this material. And here's the beauty of this, uh, you look, look at the one that Kenya's wearing, if you look at the one that Lynn is showing, right? They're all uniquely different in their own right. There are no two of these. You're really buying one of a kind designs. This material, what's exciting about it, it, it looks as, it, you know, it looks a lot like the old Kingman turquoise. It also looks a lot, in some ways, it has the characteristics of Hubei turquoise. It's not Hubei and it's not Kingman, but it, it's kind of a combination of blend of that. I, I brought, this is one of my specimens, you know, that I brought here. In, um, this is why they call it Golden Mountain. And this is a natural, this is a rarity to actually have this clean gold, just like we were showing in Gold Matrix, the Chilean turquoise. This is really prized, and that's what you really look for. Usually the Matrix is a ferrous oxide, so it's either a red or it's a black. In this case, it's this beautiful gold soft caramel color and that, that, that's why, you know, it's a gold and that's, and that's why it's, you know, it's named Golden Mountain. The nice thing about this, I guarantee you, I can absolutely 100% guarantee you, you can't go anywhere. You can't even go to Tucson. You can't go to the world's largest gem and mineral show and find this material. Um, this was, uh, we went in, we mined it out. Is there more turquoise there? Absolutely. Uh, is there any way that you'll ever be able to get it? Um, no, I mean, um, because what, what it is, it's in the side of a mountain. We actually went in as far as we can go in. Uh, the only thing that you can do now um, for safety is you would have to take down that mountain. And you know, you just, number one, we don't wanna do that. But number two, I mean, you're, you know, you're talking, I mean, it would be tens of millions of dollars. Mm. I mean, the, the most expensive thing I've learned in my life to do is move dirt. Okay, and uh, so will there be any more of this material? No, um, we've got a nice, had a nice little stash of it. We've done things like this. This is probably gonna be the biggest, boldest uh, turquoise necklace that you're gonna see in this. This was kind of our, our first kickoff on it. And so you're, you're getting to, uh, to see the, the biggest pieces, the biggest, boldest look. Uh, right off the bat. And the best of all worlds in turquoise. You get the gold matrix, you get the beautiful high blue, you get the green, you get it all in one. That's why I've always loved it. This, uh, the story behind this and the fact that it was exclusive to us and that it's at the special anniversary price, about $20 off. Okay, so some of those unique rare mine finds um, just always stand up in your hand. And I remember when Jay originally brought to us the Oasis stone and uh, the story of the discovery uh, when he came across this, I wanna say it was Australia. I'm gonna double check, but I'm almost positive. Because I remember I found it so fascinating and the color, I hope it's coming across uh, on television. It is like the deepest, deepest fern green. Almost looks like it could be black in, in some ways that you look at it. It is just, I talk about being reminiscent to one of the highest, most expensive sought after color in jade. That's exactly what we're bringing to you here. So the necklace and pendant, 
was originally $199. Uh, it's anniversary price at $173.87. We have the drop Marquis earrings. Those were $99.75. Those are $86.67. Also a featured price with five monthly flex payments. So yes, this is your saying, Oasis Stone, what in the world? That's where Jay King comes in to tell us about this unique rare mind find. Was I right? Was it, was it Australia? It is. It's Australian Oasis Stone. It's actually what it what it's I called. I thought that's yeah. And it, we actually have footage of me in a Robinson R44 helicopter um, flying over this mine, but you would never know it. But uh, that there's actually footage we we shot B-roll uh, that day um, when we were going in, and it's actually the reason they call it Oasis uh, Stone. This is in the Outback. Outback. All right. Um, Anybody ever, has ever been to the Australian Outback? There's not a lot of water. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty arid. Would uh, that would I mean pretty arid would be an understatement? Okay. Um, so uh, we're flying through there, and you see this beautiful oasis. I mean, it's just like an oasis that you know, like you would see in a film in the Sahara Desert, right? And there's this beautiful oasis and everything. Yeah, literally, there's an oasis. You got this beautiful pool of clear uh, artesian water, palm trees growing around that, all this vegetation. Just right, I mean, here's this red desert. I mean, just red, and off in the distance, you could you see these uh, beautiful greens, and you come up to it. And we fly the helicopter right over it. We're only maybe like 20 feet off the ground. We go right over the oasis. Cool. And we landed right on the other side of that, and that's why they call it o Oasis uh, Stone. It's actually mined right there. Just like you were saying, um, this is part of our gallery collection. You can see it on Kenya. When you look at a Kenya too, look at the size of this, okay? This isn't some little teeny chachki no. piece, okay? This is um, really a nice, big, bold uh, part of the gallery collection. But there, even with Kenya, I don't know what, man, she, she's got the magic light or something today. You yes. can see there where it's got that, like, that deep, kind of like emerald green. Uh, when you're showing it, um, uh, you know, on the stills and everything, it looks black. It's yeah, not. It's not. It's a beautiful, dark emerald green. It's just a really unique natural material. And do they have, I mean, where else can you find this? Do they sell this in Australia? Oh, no, is that's that, it. Is it, is it, that, this is it. It's almost like no, the No, 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 that's it. Okay. Right, uh, that's it. That one, that one deposit, that's it. And it's not like I have oodles and boodles of this. In fact, that day, uh, you know, just anybody who's ever flown helicopters, um, it's not the cheapest thing in the world you'll do, <laughs> okay? A Robinson is a lot cheaper than a Bell uh, or something. And a lot of these places that I go, um, could I take a plane? Yeah, because I, I, I'm a really, I, I have to say I'm a fairly decent bush pilot. Um, I, you know, I, I would land on some things that if you were sitting next to me, you're, you would say, you're not going to do this, right? <laughs> so, <laughs> is this one of those places, Jay? I, I've actually had people tell me, you're not really going to do this, are you? Um, but, uh, you know, in this case, uh, we had we found this. Uh, we were actually on a helicopter trip and going to the different mines that day. That's why we have that footage. That is wild. All righty. Well, we'll keep you updated there. I mentioned it just a minute ago. Uh, Jay, I, I'm going to put this here next to the side. This, very similar to what I was saying to you earlier about, you know, some of the different tennis bracelets that we can do. This is Ethiopian opal. And you know, when we first launched that, it's, it's what every opal in the entire world wishes it can be, okay? I will tell you this right off the bat, there is no way ever on television that we can show the fire that is inside this flaming opal, because I'm telling you, it is every color, multi, rainbow that you could ever imagine that flickers and, and from every direction inside these opals. It's the most valuable. Yes, we've seen Ethiopian opals in rings on occasion and in pendants, maybe once in a while in earrings. You just don't. I know, Jay, you had a very rare Ethiopian opal last night with Suzanne, just sold out, and that was $8.99. So to get triple A, and it's even in my notes where, you know, it talks about that these are graded. This is like the best of the best of Ethiopian opals making up an entire necklace. I will say this, I have fewer than 100. That's it. So three minutes or sell out today with five okay. flex pays. If you have a minute, please read okay. the reviews and, and, and bear with us. It is the most frustrating thing, Jay, not being able to have this televised like what I'm looking at here. But I am telling you, if you trust in us, there is no, there, there's nothing like the Ethiopian opal as far as color and, and fire 
within. And this and you, you know, we have a great shot. I can I can show you, you the rough material and everything. So oh, we've good. got a, a little bit better shot. And oh yes. It is frustrating. Okay. So there this is what you're looking at. Okay. This is the material. This is Ethiopian precious fire opal. Um, this is probably one of the uh, more lower end, the, the one that Lynn is showing you, but it's going to have this kind of fire, okay? Um, the only reason we're able to do this is uh, we've got a different, um, more like sunlight uh, here, but if you think this looks cool, okay, if you really think that this looks cool, wait till you get yours home yep. and, and you see it in person, and then you're really going to get the gravity of it. What makes this possible? Okay, now, this is what... This is what you're looking at, and there's not a lot of these, okay? This was what we call an opportunity buy. They come around every, every so often, and I have an opportunity to make a purchase. I got this four years ago. I've been sitting on this material for four years. If I try to cut this, and here's what it's all about. In this grade, there is no way in heck that you could actually see, you could even come close to these prices. If you go to the Tucson Gem and Mineral Show and you find these materials and you see this material uh, in this grade, every single bead is this grade. It's all triple A grade material. It is the best of the best of the best. You could even come close and I'm telling you, go to the Tucson Gem and Mineral Show the world's largest gem and mineral show in the entire planet Earth. You won't even find a single strand in this grade where every single bead is triple A grade material. You won't even, you could even buy it wholesale for that price. This was one of those crazy, crazy deals that we got from, okay, he's our source. He's our Ethiopian opal source. He is the one that goes right to the mine who's buying it from the miners. Um, I couldn't even touch the prices that he's able to do. Now, here's the deal. For me to use my AAA grade material to cut one of these necklaces, I would, I would literally have to charge you not three times, five times, five times the cost, and it would be really tough. This was something that he came to us, he approached us, he said, look, he says, I'm, you know, I'm going to have to leave early. I, here's what I'm willing to do. And, you know, we had to really, I, I have to tell you, I walked away. I didn't, I just thought, yeah, there's no way I can make that happen. This was a, a, just a mammoth purchase. It tied up a lot of money. Um, but to tell you the truth, we thought, you know what, we're going to, this is something that we, we can give our viewers really a once in a lifetime deal. Mm -hmm. Now, that being said, what we've done, we've only have certain uh, quantities in the certain s sizes that he did. And what makes this over the top is it's all triple A grade oh. Ethiopian precious opal. They're all triple A grade. This isn't a lower grade uh, me materials. The prices here that you're looking at is everything. When this is all gone, when I've worked through these strands and we're almost there now, to where we won't, you know, we've worked it over four years. We don't really have a lot of these left. When this is gone, could I ever repeat on this? I'm telling you, chances are really zero. I doubt that this will ever, ever happen in my lifetime ever again. Jay, I don't, I can't even imagine that we did it. But I'm telling you, I tied up a lot of our money, a lot of our money for a long time, four years. Our collectors know our, our, our because it's sold out. Just so that we can do Okay. Sorry, I this Skype thing, but they're telling me now with everyone in the ordering process, and, and that's never ever a surprise for us. Congratulations, and that's one uh, when you get that home with FlexPay or however you do. I would go and have that appraised immediately. You're not going to find anything like that anywhere. I mean, bottom line, not even available on. See, you can't appreciate in this shot. Oh, it just makes me crazy because it's so incredibly intense. Um, like you'll see when you when you get it, or just read the reviews on HSN.com. Okay, so 26 years ago, Jay King has been known for many things. Are we often call him our very own Indiana Jones? Uh, that he travels the world and he brings us these, finds these rare, unique mine finds and opportunity buys, and has such an amazing design team. Everything is handcrafted, but it's always been about the turquoise.
Always, always, always. Number one. It was originally 26 years ago. It was all turquoise. Then it would be lapis, which we're seeing what's happening with that now. It was colors of opal um, and coral. Now, today, to be able to see the world of even, goodness, Jay, well, we're going to talk about this, this other all-time favorite. But I'm thinking back. We, I asked you this question before. 26 years ago, how many mines, U.S. producing mines, were there of turquoise? Well, you know, um, in the United States, where I first, you know, when I first started out, okay, yeah. um, I bought, there were 26 individual different mines that I was buying material from. Now, I'm talking the 70s, right? Um, of those, of those mines, of those particular mines, right, and there's been a few added here and there, sporadic, whatever, the only one that's still in existence is the Kingman mine. It's amazing. In the mineral, the mineral park deposit. And Marty, and they're the only ones that I'm aware of that are getting commercial quantities of the uh, turquoise. So tell us about um, this, this mine. Okay, now this is like old home week. Anybody who's been shopping with us for 26 years, um, this was one of the turquoise that we, uh, about 15, 16 years ago, that that we used to, it was kind of a, a mainstay for us. Mm -hmm. And we had a lot of this material what you're looking at now is the last of the last of the material. What I always tell you, I always keep the best for last. Mm -hmm. My mentor uh, who taught me the business and actually was the person that he molded me. Um, it, you know, I'd been in the business for a long time and it was amazing that I stayed in business. <laughs> okay, <laughs> But uh, you know, I have somebody who mentored me and really kind of actually taught me how to, to really grow my business and really what you do. And one of the things that he taught me is always save your best material for last, absolutely. In this case, this is the Iron Mountain uh, turquoise mine. You're looking at the best of the best of this material. And the, the story on this that's really interesting is, you know what, there's still, it, this is one of those, this is one of these deposits that drives me crazy. Look at this high blue in this, okay? Look at, it's got like a red ferrous oxide matrix to it but this was some of the top 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 grade material that we had squirreled back in this material i went ahead and decided to release it uh, i don't have a lot we weren't able to make a lot of these um, this isn't something i can go back it's not anything that i even have any back stock on uh, what i have left is maybe i might be able to do a cup bracelet or something I cut some cabs but this will be the last time you actually see anything this big, this bold. Look at the size of, of that pendant on Kenya. I mean, this thing is massive. It's Mondo. Uh, how we found this is we were actually, we, this is a big iron open pit mine that they're commercially mining iron. Um, we had another deposit that was on top of the mountain where we were buying turquoise. And when you would go up there, I mean, it was literally ruts, four-wheel drive. I mean, you, you, without four-wheel drive, you'd never make it to the mine. Um, so when we would come down after it had rained, you would look out in that iron mine and on the very far side, you would just see it was like a rainbow mm -hmm. of turquoise. So we knew it was there. And we asked them, we went after them really hard trying to get, get permission to go in there and mine that. And they, they, they didn't want anything to do with us. They didn't want anything to do with, with the turquoise. They didn't want anything to do with it at all. And the only way that we got into this was one of my partners in the turquoise business turned out that he's the nephew of the guy who owns the turquoise, the, no the iron mine. And so he went in and let us mine this for about three years. And then um, I don't know what happened, but they basically said, look, I think we were, I don't know if we were just weren't worth the, their time or we, you know, like for them to, you know, for safety reasons and stuff like that, they just didn't want us in there. And so that ended it. I mean, so you're looking at something that I don't know of anybody else that has this material, but you're looking at some of the top, 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 top grade material. And Jay, if you're a turquoise collector that ever came out Jay of that. Jay says deposit. this all the time. I keep the best to the end. And when it's at the end, that's when you're gonna see the absolute best. It's the last that I have. So that's a, another wonderful opportunity to buy, especially on sale. Okay, when we come back,
Let's talk Ruby Tennis Necklace. Let's talk one of the best values we've ever offered uh, our Ruby Tennis Necklace. Always a customer pick and much more as we celebrate 26th anniversary with J. King. Lots of exciting things that are going on throughout this weekend here at HSN. Here's more. Perlier is an Italian bath and body company rich in history and tradition. Never far from where it started, Perlier is old world skills mixed with modern day science. Driven by a focus to treat skin with the best ingredients, Perlier continues to develop innovative new lines while staying true to its culture. Discover luxurious bath and body rituals from Italian botanical gardens with Perlier. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. There are so many reasons to shop HSN during our Brands You Love weekend. We're bringing our biggest names and brightest stars together just for you. Shop with us throughout the weekend for valuable deals you'll really love on HSN and at hsn.com. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone Care to see our gemstone enhancement chart. a great Saturday afternoon. I'm your host, Lynn Murphy, and such a pleasure celebrating our 26th anniversary of J. King, one of a kind, handcrafted mine finds in jewelry. And it's been a big afternoon so far. And I'm gonna say these next 30 minutes, beyond fabulous. To start off, we are talking about our customer pick, the one and only genuine ruby, a very rare, unique, special ruby tennis necklace. And we are so thrilled that we were able to get it back for the anniversary. But on top of that, knowing how difficult it is to get at the regular HSM price, I mean, where in the world would you ever, I said this earlier, a diamond tennis necklace, right? This is like 50 times rarer than finding a diamond tennis necklace. You just don't find ruby necklaces, tennis necklaces like this. Um, I'm not even sure where would you even go, let alone how much it would be. The fact that we are offering this today at the event price for the anniversary of $173.70 just makes it even that much more exciting and maybe that much more uh, hopefully available for you with the five flex payment, something you may have seen in the past or heard about in the past or saw in .com and thought, okay, today is the day I'm treating myself or my, you know, my daughter is born in July, my mother's born in July, my sister's born in July, my granddaughter's born in July, my wife is born in July. I am grabbing that necklace because I would never know where to even go to get her a ruby tennis necklace. And especially to see for under $35 with FlexPay, this is the great thing about HSN. I understand it's an investment, no doubt about it. You get this home, you have a 30 day money back guarantee, no questions asked. You can go and have it looked at, you can go and have it appraised. If it's not 100% what you thought it was, you just go ahead, ship it right back. You're just gonna refund, exchange, whatever you want. We make it so simple. Just as an 
opportunity as a collector, as a gemstone lover. You know, even the fact that it is all hand fastened and all handmade, but as a gemstone lover, precious gemstone lover, it's like finding the sapphire tennis necklace. It's like an emerald tennis necklace. This just happens to be a ruby tennis necklace. Do you hear the excitement in my voice? So J King, um, for those who are just tuning in, this is such an interesting background. Was, talk about an opportunity and a rare, rare find when you came across this. Uh, uh, please share that story, but I can talk about the excitement because this, you just don't. You just don't come across a ruby tennis necklace. You just don't. And if you did, well, number one, you're, you're, you're looking at yeah, a car the, the, or a house or a house. <laughs> well, again, just so you know, I've been doing this 46 years. 46 years, I've had four, four ruby designs in my life. Okay, so that's how rare a ruby is. Uh, GIA, just so everybody knows, um, they only accept four colors of red that they classify as a ruby. Otherwise, it's corundum based, so it, otherwise it's a, a, some form of sapphire. So there's only four colors that, they, that they'll that they actually cl classify as ruby. So to even get GIA to certify that it is ruby is a rarity. What makes this so rare, and you're looking at the last of the last of, of, of this material, of, of the rubies that I've ever been able to obtain, this is one of probably the most spectacular. I, I also have one that we got out of India that is, I mean, is actually very nice too. This is a very unique color of ruby. Um, you're kidding, I mean, it's a massive uh, uh, quantity. Uh, it finishes beautifully. You can see this on Kenya. I mean, this is not some little thing. And this comes from the island of Mauritius. Uh, I call it Mauritius. I'm married to a Brit, and then also Adam's British. They call it Mauritius. <laughs> so there I are, remember, okay, wait, now, Jay, wasn't it our I call show it when somebody... And I also, I tell you what, I, there are a lot of people that I know that, that are from America. They, they call it Mauritius, too. But I do. The British, but, you know, the Europeans, they call it Mauritius. Is okay, it, so wasn't potato, it with you, potato, Jay, potato, that right? uh, somebody from but, Mauritius called us in on the air? Do, do you remember that? Yes. Okay, in, Lynn, That's okay, Lynn and I, okay, Lynn and I launched this, this rough material, it's a mind fight, and this lady calls in, and she was born and <laughs> raised in Mauritius. Yes. Remember that, Lynn? Yes! She was born and raised, and she was freaking out. She goes, we're not known for mining. I mean, you know, they're known for uh, a lot of different things. Mainly, this is like, okay, it's, it's off the island of, of Madagascar. Uh, I didn't even know that much about Mauritius. I mean, I'd heard about it. I thought it was, it's a, like a holiday. It's like a Caribbean almost island. Um, so th they're not known for mining. Okay, mining is not it. And so I showed her the actually, I had the photos of, of where they mine this and where they were getting it from. And she goes, oh, I know that. That's on the Southwestern, remember that? She yes. goes, oh, that's on the Southwestern uh, portion of the island. She was even blown away. She said, oh, I didn't even know. So she didn't even know, I mean, talk about a mind find, mind find. Now, Mauritius is off of Madagascar. No telling what's really there. That, you know, this might just be the tip of the iceberg, but this is, pro this is the only thing that they mine, okay? And they don't mine this. You, you have to understand, they just found this, okay? Th this is unusual for, for this mine, for, 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 um, uh, for them to even mine anything on Mauritius, but to even find anything, and if you're gonna find something, you find a, a precious material, you find precious ruby. So um, that, that's what makes it so crazy, over the top, spectacular. You can see this on Kenya. Here again, this isn't some little tchotchke teeny beaded design. I mean, this thing is massive, massive, massive. What's it, most important, look at the size, look at the color, I mean, that's what it's all about, is having the size, having the color, the rarity. Uh, again, you're buying something precious. I don't know about you, but go to into a jewelry store. Forget it. I doubt that you'll even see a beaded ruby necklace. I've never personally seen one. Me neither. I've seen them in Europe, but I mean, they're literally in the tens of thousands of dollars. Um, you know, yeah. another thing with this, so, which is really important. A lot of people, they say, oh, it's not as red as some of the rubies, you know, I'm just a different color. 98% of them, maybe 99% of them have been enhanced. I'm not saying that's bad, okay? 
It's a very expensive process to enhance ruby or emerald or anything. It takes a lot of time, takes a lot of skill, and it's very expensive to do it. This is mother nature, guys. We haven't done anything to this at all. And that's even more beautiful, I think, because it, we left it all natural. It's not treated. There's nothing we've done to that. Oh my gosh, Lynn. Look I'm at telling that. you. Look at that baby sparkle. If you listen, if you go online, this is just from MB for me from Nevada. The the light dances and plays on these faceted stones. They sparkle like a billion. This is from I'm gonna say it's Chris Daz from Arizona. I absolutely love this ruby necklace. It is stunning. Every ruby is a gorgeous color and is faceted beautifully. Uh, this is from Al Gal One from Alabama. Absolutely gorgeous necklace. My granddaughter is going to love this. Rubies are true to color. I mean, it's the truth. Ruby, July girls out there as a special. Like, I tried in this final minute. We're busy, busy, by the way. I tried to explain it like, even rarer than a diamond tennis necklace. Isn't that true, Jay? A ruby yeah, you, you, necklace? With rubies, here, okay, here's the thing, okay? Just if you think about it, okay? Do you know of the big four, which is diamond, I'm, I'm talking precious materials, right. diamond, ruby, emerald, sapphire, okay? Do you know that ruby and emerald are way more Rare. way more uh, rare than diamonds yes. and sapphires. True. So rubies, like I said, ruby is actually in the corundum family, but there's only four colors that GI certifies as ruby. So that's a rarity. But rubies and emeralds of all of the big four precious materials, gemstone, gem materials, four uh, precious gemstones, that ruby and emerald are by rare. far the rarest of the four. Hands the down. The rarest, the Hands most hard, down. the hardest to find. That's why you don't find diamond tennis bracelets, or you know, ruby tennis bracelets, or emerald tennis necklaces. I keep saying bracelets, necklaces, even rarer than that. Um, alrighty, so we have matching pieces too. I, I went ahead. I know Kenya was wearing the, the the dangle earring. We also have the ruby earring available in a stud design. So we have two different looks for you: the oval, and oh, we have a bracelet. Oh, I put the bracelet on. A stretch bracelet that is available too. So there's the drop earring. There are $124 and 25 cents. We we have an oval solitaire stud earring that's $79.25 and then we have a stretch it's just perfect ruby with the sterling silver beads bracelet that's $124 and change look at that sparkle even from afar so the bracelet I just teamed it up with that beautiful lapis so 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 beautiful and then here let me just pull these real quick there's the stud earring so 092-718 if you want to have exactly that same exact mind find mother nature no treatment all natural, gorgeous, faceted rubies. Okay. Here's another little special surprise for Jay's 26th anniversary. I have to do this because I we previewed this at the top of the hour and already hundreds were selected. Our, 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 our collectors for Mind Finds know rare opportunities and really special, like crazy special sale price. Jay, I just have to see your face for a second because Jay does not know. Here's what's funny. When we chat, he does not know, he, he's given a flow sheet of what the flow of, of the product's gonna be in the hour. He doesn't know what the prices are. So a lot of times I'll just say, oh, if, if the, unless it's a today's special or it's an event price or something like that. But other than every other item, so I didn't tell Jay specifically. When I, when they were, you, well, I wanna see your reaction when you saw the largest tiger's eye, cat's eye necklace we've ever done at this price, Jay King, at $89.95 or 65 cents. And this is what I say is it's either stupid or crazy, okay? I got an email one I time that said, I had you know, to you're, not supposed that. To say, it's, it's supposed, you're not supposed to say stupid or you're not supposed to say crazy, but I don't but remember, so both. I always say both of them just so I make sure I cover all my bases, right? But Whichever this is definitely one, one you would put in that category, right, Jay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, you know, like, this is really crazy, and this material in, um, in, this this is uh, material comes from Namibia, but in tiger's eye, cat's eye, of this color, uh, with this effect, is the most one of the most limited that you can get. I mean, there's not a lot of it. This is probably the biggest and boldest we've ever done. I just want to let everybody know. Do you know how hard I work? Okay, or we work. I mean, you know, it's it's not about I. I mean, I have a great team, um, but that we work really, really, really hard. And we work really close to the vest to be able to provide 
beautiful products at a crazy, crazy price. Really, here again, you're buying it manufacturer direct. It doesn't get any more direct. And when we say manufacturers, okay, we're even different than other manufacturers. We're, we're like a total niche business because we, we go right, in this case, right to source in Namibia. We buy the rough material. All the design, I designed this, you could tell it's big. <laughs> you know, all the laboratory work, all of that, we do in-house. And then we bring it directly here to you. There's no middleman. That's why we're able to give you the crazy prices that we give you in the first place. That, that's why we're able to do what we do. And then to be able to offer it, and then they're doing the sale price. I, I mean, which is, I mean, I, I don't know where you would go, number one, and find the material definitely in this design and this size and even come close to this. I mean, this is costume jewelry pricing, to be honest with you, Jay. I mean, this would be something that you would see in simulated If stone. I told you just what the sterling silver finding on this cost, right. you know, because we, we make these findings, okay? And when I make them, I have to make them 10,000 at a time. And you say, well, why? Well, because it's our, this is our signature finding. It's what we use on the majority of our necklaces. So when we do a run on them, we manufacture 10,000 of them at a time. If I just shared with you what that costs right now, what what it's costing me to build those, to make those findings, you would go, how on earth do they do it? Can you even do necklaces for even anywhere anywhere close to this price? So this is a great, great, great value. And I go way back with this material. I mean, um, we used to go to Namibia back in the, it wasn't the 70s, it was actually started the early 80s. And at that time, they had a, the Namibian government wouldn't allow you to export the tiger's eye, cat's eye rough out of the country unless it was in finished goods. So we used to buy the highest grade, biggest things. We used to have them carved. At first, we'd buy Buddhas and we'd buy camels, all kinds of things, anything elephants, anything that was really big or huge or something that we could, because we were going to take them back to New Mexico and we we're going to chop them up into cabochons because you could, you know, it, it was really hot. And then um, we got where we start making book markers. We'd be big, big slabs and, we, you know, like for uh, whole books together, or we would have ashtrays, the great big pieces like this that were, and we'd have a little divot in the middle and we would export it as an ashtray. And we kind of figured it out and, you know, we were able to cut it up. So this material now you can export the rough, but I'm just telling you, um, you know, and I know you do see a lot of tiger's eye, you see a lot of this material out there in the market. What makes this different is the grade of the material, the look overall design of the material, and the quality of the material. Oh, no doubt. It's like as perfect and as flawless as you get. So there's red tiger's eye in here. There's brown tiger's eye in here. There's that little nuggets of the cat's eye. So there's continuous movement. That's why this is so fascinating. You know, as we're getting ready, uh, we're actually launching, I thought it was last week, but we did have a few fall fashion shows last week. But think about all these colors for a second that we're seeing um, going in, especially your earth tone colors. You know, your browns, your cocos, your chocolates, your camels, how rich looking that would be. And it's the real deal. This is not faux. And the, the larger of the beads here are 14 millimeters. Actually, some are 16 millimeters, uh, an actual size. This is gonna be that go-to piece. That is your, that movement piece that people are just like, she has the most beautiful jewelry. Where did you find something like that? And with FlexPay, when you shop using any major credit card, debit card, PayPal, uh, whatever, whatever is your easiest way of shopping with us if you're set up like that, why not split those payments up over the next five months? That would be under $18, and we're gonna ship this at home. And it is, I mean, it is a bold, glorious piece. You can see when I hold that up. And I do wanna mention, many of you are asking about the ring. Yes, that's also in the tiger's eye. We have matching earrings, and then we have a matching um, bracelet that's also gonna be available for you. So we'll give you that information if you get something and take advantage, I mean, the, this alone, what are we there, $30 savings, right? Am I doing my math correctly? Or I think somewhere in there, yeah. $30 savings from our original HSN price. And normally if we do, let's say tiger's eye, we don't have it in the red tiger's eye, we don't have it in the earth tone colors, we don't have the cat's eye also involved with it. So that's another you know, special treat that you have here. Really, really, really special, big and bold, definitely a J King design, no doubt about that. And then right there, right there to the side 096817, that's for the ring. That We also have a stretch bracelet. And then um, I believe Kenya, yeah, she, she has the whole suite on. And then we have the drop earrings. 
that are currently available for you. So if I'm just tuning in, Jay King, this is a really special, not just because of the value. I, I get excited about that, just even at $110. But this is another one of those finds. We're talking a lot about Tucson Gem, right, show Where right. this is where people would just like get the best of the best of Tiger's Eye and Cat's Eye and the different colors and really, you know, hope to get a great buy to be able to do something special like this. Would yeah, go. This is something that you that you could actually go to uh, Tucson um, Gem Show. In fact, we do have footage. And um, we buy directly in Namibia, but, um, but the miners that mine this for us, they actually come to Tucson. So they do have the material and we've actually photographed them there. And you know, the thing with tiger's eye, cat's eye, it has the property, one of the rare properties that mother nature does and it's called chatoyancy. And we, I have a specimen here, I can show you the sample that, and, what, what makes Chatoyant so unique and so different, you can see it has this wet look on it, but it also has micro crystals growing through that, uh, through the material. So it naturally gleams and glows. There's no way I could polish it to that color and actually have it come out as that color. It wouldn't look like that. It naturally has the property of Chatoyant So cool. So, Okay, I'm gonna demonstrate. This is yeah. the property of chatoyancy. Okay, I'm not doing anything. That's not because that's highly polished. That's because of the natural material. And that's because you've got crystals growing through this in the, in the mother rock and the host rock. You've got those crystals that are growing. In this case, it's asbestos crystals in uh, cat's eye and turquoise. And then everybody, I remember when I first said that, people said, oh my God, asbestos, no it won't hurt you, okay? <laughs> it's, not, it's not that form. There, you know, asbestos is not the fiber. It's not a, it's asbestos fiber. It's actually asbestos crystal, the crystalline form, and that's what makes it gleam and glow. And what you're seeing is the light bounce off mm -hmm. of that, of the crystals growing inside here. That's what you're seeing. You're seeing that light, and that's what you're gonna have in your necklace too. It's gonna do the same thing. It's gonna glow, it's gonna gleam, it's gonna sparkle. Some of it from the fasting we do, but the majority of it yeah, from what Mother Nature did. Right, exactly. All right. Uh, we are very, very busy. Hundreds and hundreds of these have now been selected first time at that sale price. Let me showcase the matching pieces, the ring, we have the earrings, and then we also have uh, the matching stretch bracelet. So they're all available. The bracelet's $60.75, the earrings are $60.75, and then the ring, which we have five through size 12, is $91. Oh, that necklace on you, Kenya. This whole ensemble, your skin tone, just so beautiful. And I love that you're getting the, the makeup here of the most co popular colors of cat's eye, but then also the red, and then the, the original tiger's eye that we love so much. So definitely a, a, a very, very special treat. For the anniversary, 096-817 is the item number. Okay, so we're gonna talk about another rare, rare mind find from J. King uh, that we have not mentioned one thing about, and that is chrysocolla. And this color of chrysocolla, oh, I gotta just, let me slip this ring on here too. In this pendant, so we have the necklace, we have the ring, we have the matching earrings, and they're all featured price. This is a very special, specialized uh, color in the rare chrysocolla. It's a, and, and as close as we can get, guys, because I'm telling you, it's like going into another galaxy. It, it really, it's the best way for me to describe it. It's like, this is what you look for from Mother Nature. Like you never in a million years even knew, even there. And that's of course what Jay brings to us. So we have the pendant uh, and necklace at $197.95 featured price, the ring five through 12. And then we also have the stud earrings. This entire collection, my producer Jared just told me, is beyond limited. So I'm gonna go right out to Jay. It's gonna be a two minute or sellout special. Jay, this is like the cream of the crop um, when we talk about Chrysocolla. Am I, Chrysocolla, am I correct in saying that? Uh, th this material, to tell you the truth, in Chrysocolla, do you know that there's a lot of Chrysocollas that actually people have from the 70s and 80s that, um, that, they, that they were calling turquoise, right? And people back then, you know, they were buying it. Now, were they, were they, were they intentionally um, doing that? No. I mean, Chrysocolla is so close to turquoise, it's unbelievable. It's only like, I think, two elements off 
of actually being turquoise, being able to call it turquoise, but it's not, it's chrysocolla. All chrysocollas are not created equally. Okay, it's actually a really rare material, it's a rare occurrence. You don't really find, it's even rarer than turquoise. Um, I, I haven't seen it a lot. I've only seen it a handful of times in my entire life. Um, this comes from Bruce Barlow, okay? It comes from his private collection. Bruce uh, mined this in Mexico um, at least 20 years ago. He had it, he had this massive, beautiful, you've actually seen photos of me with it. He had this beautiful specimen that was massive. It must've been three, three feet in diameter. He, sell, he sold it to a, I can't tell you who, but a, let's just say somebody you would know who it is for their house and uh, he's for a quarter of a million dollars, okay, for the specimen. This is the same material. This was what was left over that was around the specimen, what he got out of that, out of that operation. He, uh, we finally worked a deal uh, on this. I knew about it for a long, long time, but we never could come to grips on price, right? Mm -hmm. Because it is a rare, rare material. And he finally, uh, three years ago, relented and you're looking at some of the last of the last. But if you want chrysocolla, which is a natural occurrence, and it's very rare, it's a rare occurrence, especially in this grade. You don't see it in this grade. This is collector grade. This is actually specimen grade, uh, chrysocolla. It's, it's one of, it's not just one of the nicest grades of chrysocollas I've ever had in my life. I can say without a doubt, 100%, it is the hands down nicest chrysocolla. God, I wish I could get material like this. And that being said, we don't have any more. Everything that you're seeing, that was actually the last design that we did. Oh and that material, that's, we, we're out of it. We don't have any. And it's just about gone. In all the pieces. In the pendant, in the ring, in the matching earrings, but all at this featured price. I'm just doing, I know they, we were gonna do an encore presentation, so I was putting on my neon, <clears throat> oh, sorry about that, appetite necklace. Um, that earlier we did a full presentation. I want to say how many, over 600 have now been selected. This like the, the ruby necklace, this like uh, so many things that Jay brings to us and mine finds, you just do not find. And I mean, even just appetite in general, this is one of the most sought after appetites, the neon appetites, like lit within. I've never even presented a neon tennis necklace before. And today we have it specially priced at $122.50. We also have a matching linear earrings. Those were $52.04 featured price. There they are on .com. Everything's available with five flex payments. I wanna say, what was it, Jared? Like 600 necklaces or so? All right, well over half the quantity. I'm not surprised in the least. I tell you, as I was saying before, it's like the best of every blue you could think of. It's a halo of neon blue light from turquoise to teal to royal blue um, to every color, to, to coal, to even just like a, a cornflower blue. You will love that necklace. Um, so popular, thrilled to have it available. It's the only one of its kind, 096722. Okay, we have to do a hit. You got a little sneak peek, because. This next special that we're gonna highlight for you, speaking of blues, this is like the heavenly clouds of blue. It will take your breath away. And what we're looking at here, it's like, uh, it's an agate, but we're looking at it's a, a, a beautiful like lace, similar to that of a lace agate, but look at how big and bold these graduated discs are. Bolder at the, at the center and then they graduate a little bit smaller as it goes around. $124.75. Jay King, I know it's gonna be a, it's a two minute special. We don't have many. I'm expecting every last one of these to sell out, but agates, especially this, I know this is one of your favorite cuts too, isn't it, Jay? It is, but okay, so let me explain this material. Okay, this is blue, it's not blue lace agate, okay? It's actually blue agate. Um, this is how rare this is. I was in Malawi and I was working with the, the miner who had mined all the uh, Malawi sapphire that you've seen on my show. And we went and did that, that buy, that purchase. Um, we were finalizing the deal and so um, Kelly was going around, he was, he was uh, sorting through the last of the sapphire. They were labeling everything. Doing what I do, I walk around and I walk around and I found six barrels of this material. And I asked him, what is it? I didn't know, I thought maybe it was blue chalcedony, but it was mm. too hard. So I didn't think it was a chalcedony. So as far as I know, those are the only six 55 gallon drums ever mined 
He didn't have any more. He said when they were digging the sapphire, they found this. They had just a small vein that they mined and they mined out. Could you go chase that again? Maybe, I don't know if it'd be worth it. But this is something that's really a rarity. And also you don't see agate. You know, you usually see anything. The only other blue agate that I'm aware of is blue lace. Yeah. Anything in this color, this doesn't have the lacing in it. That is what makes it different. It is a, it's, but it's like glow in the dark uh, blue. It's got the most pure, pure, pure blue you um, just, that you'll ever see. You read my mind. We tend to do that after all these years. I was saying it's like glows in the dark. It has, I was seeing it like clear across the studio. I was like, there, that's like lit. That's another lit within. It truly <laughs> glows. Okay, J. King, 26th anniversary continues. I know later this evening, you're coming up at Sarah. eight o'clock. Eight o'clock with Sarah. Okay. And, and then Sunday, I've got two shows, one with Shannon, one with Adam, and then I'm not back for seven weeks. All right. That's too long. Happy anniversary, my friend. They are scooting me out. Happy Saturday, everybody. Enjoy all of your beautiful J. King.